Matthew Nellister Grant of River Sally St. Patrick, who resided at Lapo Tree St. Andrew and at Beaulieu St. George, passed away on Thursday, March 10, 2022, at the age of 70. He was the father of Cherry Ann Booker Cyrus in the USA, Cheryl Ann Booker Bethel, Corporal 939 Chanel Cummings, and Akim Adolphus, brother of Michael, also known as Lavesta, Wilbur, Gloria, Maglen, and Magna, grandfather of Rianne and Ariana Cyrus in the USA, and Gabrielle Bethel, father-in-law of Ricky Cyrus, Handy Bethel, and Reginald Cummings, many nieces and nephews in Grenada, Trinidad, and the USA, including Janice, Shirley Ann, Samuel, Deanne, Catherine, Rolda, Wayne, Michael, Ashton, Jenny, and Annette. Other relatives and friends, including the Grand Family of Lapo Tree, River Sally, Paradise, and Monroe's in Trinidad, Canada, and the USA, the Whiteman Family of St. David, the Adolphus Family of Bolio, the Niles Family of Darbo, Diego and Heads of Lapo Tree, Glenn Lewis and Family, Sharon de Berg, and friends and neighbors of Bolio, Lapo Tree, and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Matthew Nalista Grant of River Sally St. Patrick, who resided at Lapo Tree St. Andrew and Beaulieu St. George, will take place on Thursday, March 31st at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Holy Family Catholic Church, River Sally St. Patrick, and interment will be at the River Sally Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Cyprian Batiste, also known as Sippo and Dread, of Providence, who resided at Petmotar St. David, former salesman and managing director of Value Landscape in Grenada and Value Mini Mart, passed away on Thursday, 3rd March 2022, at the age of 62. He was the husband of Marl Batiste, father of Marcus and Morris Batiste and Marsha Franklin, grandfather of Mariah, Kiara, Kayla, Caleb, Caden, and Karina brother of Daniel Thomas in Trinidad and Teresa Thomas in England, brother-in-law of Maureen Morel in St. Thomas, Gordon in Trinidad, Michael, Kang, and John, father-in-law of Kizzy Batiste and Leoth Franklin, uncle of many. Many cousins, other relatives and close friends including James Lewis and family, Victor Scott and family, Hyacinth McBarnett and family, Rosie and family, Sharon and family, Cynthia and family, Kester and family, the Blake family of Corinth, the Batiste family, Pastor Thomas and family, the Duncan family of Vincent's, the Albert family of Dudmar, the Mapp and Horsford families, the management and staff of Value Distributors and Value Landscape in Grenada, the pastor and members of the First Baptist Church, Barot St. David, and friends and neighbors of Barot, Providence, Padmata, Belle Plaine, La Mode, St. Vincent, St. Thomas, the UK, and Trinidad. The funeral of the late Cyprian Batiste, also known as Sippo and Dread, of Providence, who resided at Petmotar St. David, will take place on Thursday, March 31st at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Petmotar Gospel, according to First Baptist Church rites, and entombment will be at the family cemetery Petmotar. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lakwa Brothers Funeral Homes. Lloyd Edric Chetram, also known as Babu and Caesar, of Brothers St. John, passed away on Friday, 11th March 2022, at the age of 71. He was the brother of Valentine and Keith Chetram, nephew of Rosalind Julian in the UK, brother in law of Brenda and Louise Chetram. Uncle of many including Jason, Judy, Janice Chetram Hagley, Jerry, Sharon, Lyndon, Sherry, Ken, Ian, Kay, Ricky, Robbie and Jeanette Chetram, Beverly Chetram Dolland, Roald Chetram Justine, and Daniel also known as Bubby in the United Kingdom. Uncle-in-law of many including Ken Hagley, Akima Fraser, David Justine, Evelyn Dolland, Suti Chetram, Lexan Chetram, Bibi Husman Chetram, and Casey Eben Chetram. 
Many other relatives and friends, including the Sanderson, Chittaman, Perryman, Ragbasingh, Duranjit, Harford, Chetram, Julian, and Harriman families, the Rajman family in Tobago, the Roberts family in Grenada, the UK, and the USA, Shireen Amanda Wall, Pastor Robert Mathena and family, members of the Faith Independence Baptist Church Loreto, Lester Simpson, Nurse Marcia Jones, Laura Joseph, the Alexis family, and friends and neighbors of brothers and surrounding areas. The funeral of the late Lloyd Edric Chetram, also known as Babu and Caesar, of Brother St. John, will take place on Friday, April 1st at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Open Bible Church, Grove St. John, and interment will be at the Douglaston Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Veronica Dola Horsford, née Bascom, of Retreat St. David, passed away on Tuesday, 8th March, 2022, at the age of 94. She was the mother of Yvette Lowe, Gregory Bascom, Bernadette Fall, Richard Horsford, Marcia Hazard, Matthew and Sharon Horsford, stepmother of Martin Lumpress, grandmother of Nigel, Neil and Neela Duncan, Rodlin Lowe, Winston and Randy Bascom, Sophia Charles, Michelle, Rachel and Marcel Horsford, Marcel Hazard and Quinton, great-grandmother of 25, many nieces and nephews including Daphne Bascom, Eric Bascom, Teresa Edwards, Gloria Mitchell, Philip George and Leon Mitchell, mother-in-law of Claudia Bascom, Janice and Belinda, sister-in-law of Lawrence Francis, Clarice Charles, Gwen, Tony and Joan Murray. Other relatives and friends including Raleigh Jessamy, Dandley Bascom, the Bascom family of Felix Park, Happy Hill and River Road, the Latouche, Horsford and Felix families, and neighbors and friends of Retreat, Palmrose, Felix Park and De Blando. The funeral of the late Veronica Dola Horsford, née Bascom, of Retreat St. David, will take place on Monday, April 4th at 2 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the St. Martin de Porres Roman Catholic Church, Crochu St. Andrew, and interment will be at the Churchyard Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Ian Redhead, also known as Flyers, of Hillsborough Street, who resided at Melville Street and Archibald Avenue, St. George's, son of the late Betha and Pat Redhead, passed away on Friday, 11th March, 2022, at the age of 63. He was well known as the founder and editor of Tackle Sports magazine. He is survived by his devoted wife, Deborah, children Ian Dikoto, Zaya Bourne, Adayinka, and Oksana Redhead, proud grandfather of Ziana, Zuri, and Zacharias, daughter-in-law, Rocio Mota Dikoto, dearly missed by his siblings, Rosamond, residing in England and Nigeria, Annette and Patty, residing in Grenada, Margaret, also known as Git, the late Adrian, also known as Pencil, Gordon, also known as Police, and John, also known as Pussy, residing in the United States, and Trevor, also known as Bessie, residing in Canada. He will be lovingly remembered by his mother-in-law, Yvonne Alexander, father-in-law, Lloyd Alexander, many nieces, nephews, sisters-in-law, and brothers-in-law, other relatives including the Charles, Hopkin, and Marichaux family close friend of Sammy Braffitt and family, and Rafael Arthur in the United States, Ruggles and Tammy Ferguson, Nazim Burke, Merle and Jeffrey Bayer, Randolph Peters and family, Nurse Cloudon and family, Clem John, Margaret Matushek, Noel Thomas in Canada, and other loved ones. The funeral service for the late Ian Redhead, also known as Flyers of Hillsborough Street, who resided at Melville Street and Archibald Avenue, St. George's, will take place on Wednesday, April 6th at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Cathedral of the Immaculate Conception, St. George's, and interment will be at the Top Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Velma Ada Murray of Mount Rich St. Patrick, who resided at Grenville Street, St. George's, passed away on Friday, 4th March, 2022, at the age of 71. She was the mother of Joyce Murray Allen in the USA, Jerry Murray, 
Nigel Murray and Louise Murray, grandmother of Brandon Murray, Kenny Allen and Kai Murray in the USA, Daniel Patris, Shimron Millet, Shemaika Regis and Lamorne Murray, sister of Patricia Belgrave, Stafford Murray, Michael Murray, Glenna Evans in Trinidad, Yoland Ledlow, Terence, Ruby and Rick Murray, mother-in-law of Asuna Regis and Rodnisha Joseph Murray. Aunt of 23 including Paul Belgrave, Josie and Murray, Ria Murray, Nola Murray, Shannon and Shakima Ledlow, Nadine Paul and Jerrel Murray. Grand aunt of 43. Niece of Priscilla Smart, Osbert Charles and Patlin. Sister-in-law of Boblin Murray, Joseph Ledlow, Yvonne Murray and Anthony Evans. Numerous cousins are the relatives and friends including Merlin David in the USA, Edward and Mary Lord, Mr and Mrs Allen in the USA, the Smart, Julian, Murray and Mungo families, Cindy Philip, Pansy Barito, Maggie, Pearl, Daphne and Mary Man, Peggy, Juliet Dicoto, the staff of GCNA and friends and neighbors of Mount Rich St Patrick and Grenville Street St George's. The funeral of the late Velma Ada Murray of Mount Rich St Patrick who resided at Grenville Street St George's will take place on Thursday, April 7th at 1 p.m. Funeral service will be held at the Seventh Day Adventist Church Archibald Avenue St George's and entombment will be at the St George's Centre Cemetery. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Ambrose Emmanuel Sylvester, also known as Bully of Molinaire St. George passed away on Wednesday 23rd March 2022 at the age of 96 the funeral arrangements for the late Ambrose Emmanuel Sylvester also known as Bully of Molinaire St. George will be given in a subsequent broadcast funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home Lucille Maxime, also known as Alcina Chase of Grand Arm St. George, died on Wednesday, 23rd March 2022, at the age of 82. The funeral arrangements for the late Lucille Maxime, also known as Alcina Chase of Grand Arm St. George, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Carly James, also known as Black Boy and Baggy of Bolio St. George, died on Tuesday, 22nd March 2022 at the age of 69. The funeral arrangements for the late Carly James, also known as Black Boy and Baggy of Bolio St. George, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Daphne Joseph, also known as Datty of Latan St. David, passed away on Wednesday, 16th March 2022, at the age of 87. The funeral arrangements for the late Daphne Joseph, also known as Datty of Latan St. David, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Leonard Abraham McMillan, also known as Leonard Glad, and Tawe of Bellevue St David passed away on Saturday 19th March 2022 at the age of 68 the funeral arrangements for the late Leonard Abraham McMillan also known as Leonard Glad and Tawe of Bellevue St David will be given in a subsequent broadcast funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes Edward Mordred Roberts, also known as E.M. Roberts of Belmont St. George, died on Saturday 19th March 2022 at the age of 86. The funeral arrangements for the late Edward Mordred Roberts, also known as E.M. Roberts of Belmont St. George, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Teresa Cummings, also known as Carmen of Bolio St. George, passed away on Saturday 19th March 2022 at the age of 81. The funeral arrangements for the late Teresa Cummings, also known as Carmen of Bolio St. George, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. 
funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Paul Joseph, also known as Preacher, of Cemetery Hill St. George's, passed away on Thursday, 17th March 2022, at the age of 73. The funeral arrangements for the late Paul Joseph, also known as Preacher, of Cemetery Hill St. George's, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Agnes Barry, also known as Loyola, of La Fortune St. Patrick, who resided in the USA, passed away on Saturday, 12th March 2022 in Canada, at the age of 77. The funeral arrangements for the late Agnes Barry, also known as Loyola, of La Fortune St. Patrick, who resided in the USA, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Sebastian Francis Richardson, also known as Cebu, of Tivoli St. Andrew, passed away on Monday 14th March 2022, at the age of 62. The funeral arrangements for the late Sebastian Francis Richardson, also known as Cebu, of Tivoli St. Andrew, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Anita Blackett, also known as Mama Anita, of Padmatar St. David, passed away in Trinidad at the age of 89. The funeral arrangements for the late Anita Blackett, also known as Mama Anita of Padmatar St. David, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Sybil Matilda Roberts, also known as Mama and Pity, of New Hampshire St. George, passed away on Sunday 13th March 2022 at the age of 81. The funeral arrangements for the late Sybil Matilda Roberts, also known as Mama and Pity, of New Hampshire St. George, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Teresa Smith, also known as Farmo, of Carrier, who resided at Telescope St. Andrew, passed away on Thursday, 17th March 2022, at the age of 84. The funeral arrangements for the late Teresa Smith, also known as Farmo, of Carrier, who resided at Telescope St. Andrew, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. George Ferguson of Chantemel St. Patrick died on Sunday, 13th March, at the age of 73. The funeral arrangements of the late George Ferguson will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements have been entrusted to Bailey's Funeral Home. Monica Cynthia Knight Martin, affectionately known as Monix, of Mount Moritz St. George, passed away on Sunday 6th March 2022, at the age of 87. The funeral arrangements for the late Monica Cynthia Knight Martin, affectionately known as Monix of Mount Moritz St. George, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Veronica Horsford, née Bascom, of Retreat St. David, who resided in the USA, passed away on Tuesday 8th March 2022 at the age of 94. The funeral arrangements for the late Veronica Horsford née Bascom of Retreat St. David, who resided in the USA, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Homes. Joseph Peterson of Chantemel St. Patrick who resided in the United Kingdom, passed away on Friday, 25th February in the UK at the age of 87. The funeral arrangement of the late Joseph Peterson of Chantemel St. Patrick, who resided in the United Kingdom, will be given in a subsequent broadcast. Funeral arrangements have been entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Funeral Home. In loving memory of Deslin Veronica Thomas of Paradise St. Andrew, who passed away in the USA on 23rd March 2020 and was entombed at the Grand Bra Cemetery. It's been two years since you've been gone. 
but it seems like only yesterday. Our hearts split in two. One side filled with memories, the other died with you. We often lie awake at nights while the world is fast asleep and take a walk down memory lane with tears upon our cheeks. Remembering you is easy. We do it every day. But missing you is a heartache that never goes away. We hold you tightly within our hearts and there you will remain. Gone forever, but not forgotten. From your loving family Denise, Denny, Deborah, Debbie, Davis, Devon, Dorian, and Tomel. Freenewell arrangements were entrusted to Lacqua Brothers Freenewell Homes. In memory of Chad Joseph Edgehill of Grand Mall St. George, who resided in New York and passed away on March 29, 2012, at the age of 24. He was laid to rest on April 12, 2012. Left to cherish his memory are his mom, Myrna Anne Marie Joseph, grandmother Gillian Catherine Joseph, many aunts and uncles, including Tessa Edgehill Gittens, Rachel and Bernadette Joseph, and numerous other family members and friends. Don't think of him as gone away. His journey's just begun. Life holds so many facets. This earth is only one. Just think of him as resting from the sorrows and the tears in a place of warmth and comfort where there are no days and years. Think how we must be wishing that we could know today how nothing but our sadness can really pass away. And think of him as living in the hearts of those he touched. For nothing loved is ever lost, and he was loved so much. Freenewell arrangements were entrusted to Bailey's Freenewell Home. The management and staff of MTV extend deepest condolences to those of you whose loved ones have passed on. Thanks for watching. I am Godwill James, an MD and a member of Gateway Assembly. Medically, death is regarded as an end or a cessation of life. Different, um, different groups view death in different perspectives, while some regard death as a continuation of life, others view it as an infable form of life. As a Christian, we may want to view death as a separation of the soul from the body. So, whichever way one may, view, one may view death, I want to say that may the gentle soul of the faithful departed rest in the bosom of the Lord. Amen. Amen.